welcome back to my channel. My name is Sandra and I'm a nurse practitioner. And today I'm going to show you how to properly use crutches. So this is an older pair of crutches. I already have them sized to my height. On these older wooden types, you have to undo the bolts and adjust it to your height. And you also have to adjust the hand grips. On the newer crutches, they are made out of aluminum. It's just the push of a button and usually there is a height marker on there and it's much easier to adjust to your height. Okay, so when you are adjusting crutches for your height, you want to stand up straight and the top of the crutch should come about two to three finger widths or one to two inches from the armpit. They should not be pushing up into the armpit and you should never lean down onto them like this because that can cause nerve damage as well as pain when you're using your crutches. So when you're using crutches, your weight is going to be supported in your hands and your wrists. And so you wanna make sure your crutches are fitted comfortably. So these are adjusted to my height at the armpits. The hand grips should line up about where your wrist hits. So that's pretty comfortable there for me. When you're using the crutches, you wanna have a slight bend in your elbows. So crutches are typically used when your doctor or healthcare provider wants you to be non-weight bearing on a leg that has had a recent injury or a surgery. And gradually while you're using crutches, you will become more weight bearing on the affected leg. So let's just say my right leg is the injured leg. You're gonna start non-weight bearing on that leg. So you're going to put all the weight in your hands. You're going to move the crutches ahead about a foot, lean forward slightly and swing the good leg through. So when you're first starting out, it's difficult to remember to look ahead, but you want to look ahead and not look down at your feet. And it's just like driving a car. So you'll keep your eyes on the road. And as you get more comfortable, you will get faster on crutches and you can take longer strides. So we always tell patients to be very careful on crutches, especially if it's rainy outside or icy out, because that's something that can just cause the crutches to slip right out from underneath you. Okay, so next I'm going to demonstrate how to sit back into a chair with your crutches. Okay, so keeping your affected leg up, you're going to back up into the chair until you can feel it behind you. And then you're going to bring the crutch around to the injured side holding them both in the same hand. And you're going to reach behind you, either grab the top or the seat of the chair and lower yourself down. And so you're using the crutch on this side as a brace and support on this side to get you safely into the chair. And then when you wanna get back up, you're just gonna grab onto the seat, hold onto the handles and push yourself back up and then bring one crutch around and you're back ready to go. Okay, so this is my mom. She's never used crutches before, so we'll see if she can do it based on my demo. All right, so you remember how to do it? Yep, bad leg up, crutches ahead of you. Swing forward and swing through, yep. Keep my head up. Yep, straight ahead. Okay, so 
now I'm going to show you how to use crutches to go upstairs. So a way to remember how to go up and down, we remember the saying, up with the good, down with the bad. So when you're going up the stairs, you're going to go up with your good foot first. And when you're coming down the stairs, you're going to come down with your affected or injured leg first. So we will go up first. Okay, so you're going to bring the crutches over to the injured side and you're gonna support yourself with the rail if you have one. If you don't have a rail, you can go up with the crutches and I can demonstrate that after. I'm gonna show you with the rail. Okay, so stairs are pretty tricky and you may wanna start out with someone helping you because they can be pretty dangerous. So don't even attempt to do stairs by yourself if you don't feel comfortable. So you're going to approach the stairs and you're going to bring the crutch from the good side over to the injured side. Put them under your arms, grab the handrail and up with the good. So supporting your weight in your affected side and on the handrail, you're going to push yourself up the stair and you're going to do one stair at a time. Okay, and then when you're coming back down, you're gonna bring your injured leg ahead of you, and that is going to go down first, along with the crutch, and then you're going to bring your good leg down afterwards. So crutch down, a foot ahead, support your weight in the rail and the crutch, and bring down your good foot. Alright guys, so I hope this video was helpful on how to properly use crutches. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for future content. Alright everyone, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.